On the telephone now, Manny Gomez, terrorism expert, as I understand it. Manny, you there? Well, interestingly, he had a conversation. Manny, can you hear us? Okay, we'll try to establish yeah. that as soon as we can. You but, know, uh, um, another quote that the president had is he labeled this an outrageous attack, not just on the people of Paris, but on all of its allies as well. And our way of life. I think, exactly. I think Manny's back on the phone. Manny, are you there? Yes, I am. Uh, Hi, how are you? Uh, Manny, what can you make of this? Three apparently seemingly uh, connected attacks. What do you make of what's happening in Paris right now? Well, uh, I mean, it, it seems to me like it's utter chaos. They clearly didn't expect this. And uh, these are obviously a very highly planned attacks acting in concert at the same time. And uh, it appears to me that they were successful. This on the heels of the earlier attack, uh, the Parisians must be very scared, and uh, it's a situation that, as the president indicated, we are going to lend our full support in both our intelligence and uh, our significant law enforcement resources that are embedded in Paris, uh, both FBI, CIA, and, and, and YPD. Uh, here in New York, I'm sure that we are, uh, the NYPD is doing uh, everything to protect what resources we have here. Uh, the uh, division is on full alert, and uh, we're trying to figure out if there is a potential attack here as well. Manny, when you think about the layers of security and the sophistication uh, that we know that we have in this city and this country when it comes to listening to terrorists, following them on the internet, and then you see something like this happen in Paris, what does that what does that reveal? What does that tell you? I mean, how could that happen? I think a lot of people are wondering. Well, uh, let's keep in mind that uh, other countries, as resourceful as they are, are not as advanced as we are and not as aggressive as we are in, in protecting our own. Uh, the French have had problems for years. Uh, we, as a country, as a government, have advised them as to how to uh, better curtail their issues, uh, and there's they're still a work in progress. Uh, as you reported, we uh, have had 12 uh, attacks, potential attacks, that have been thwarted by the local authorities, and uh, I have every confidence that the NYPD and the local FBI uh, will prevent anything uh, potentially as an aftershot, uh, as an aftermath of this to, to happen in New York City. So, the, the French have to really take a very close look at their intelligence and their law enforcement after this attack. We're watching the French president.